Alright, continue where we left off. Dredging the depths. Where were we at? Let's see. So we're doing a new book. Pursue, we need to search for the relics. Find the key. Find the music. I think we needed to go to Gale Cliffs. Which would be... Here. But I wanted to get the hull upgraded. We needed one more piece of lumber. Let's purchase... That's the rod spaces, okay. And then we need... A lot more stuff. And something we haven't seen before. Refined metal? Where do I get refined metal from? Two pieces of wood and refined metal. Let's let's go dredge. Pretty sure we have plenty of money. Um, was there anything else that we need to go check? No, no. So let's head toward. Those islands over there. Probably won't do any fishing until we get out there, though. Ooh, stuff to dredge for, though. We will get this. Alright, we're gonna go fishing. It's already night time. Where's that boat? Let's go get this. This fishy. That was probably not a good idea. Hmm. That one doesn't look as crazy as the other ones did. do that. It'll fit right there. Okay, so let's get back to the town. fit for the night. Oh. Forgot to put it under the right thing. Is that two hundred dollars? 
so much money. Let's hold off on the crab pots. Let's put those away. Okay. Let's wake up at four. Ish. There we go. And then we'll head across to that new place. Does that boat just disappear when night comes around? Or morning? That's a buoy. Going the right way? Yeah. Let's get over there pretty quick. See what we can find. There's a boat wreck. A rotten many or a rotten mass lies lays down on this island, half hidden by the foliage. At its base an old boat is cracking too. Just look inside, dude. Bag of doubloons. This ought to fetch a decent price somewhere. Sweet. Put that here. Put this in that corner. Put that there, and then one research part. Oh yeah, dude. It's good. All right, I think we gotta go to. I guess either one of those places, right? Let's check out what's going over going on over here. Catch some fish. Oh, that's a new fish. Black mouth salmon. Could fit another one. Ahoy there, you're a new face, a fisherman I take it. Perfect, well, we should get along like a house on fire, haha. -ha. I'm a traveler, a merchant, all rolled into one. If you have any fish to sell, I'll take them on, I'll take them on board and sell them at the next town I come across. Likewise, I haul a small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to pursue the stock. Pursue the stock and see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. Okay. Uh, let's go to the fish market. I also keep crab pots. That's good. So let's sell those. Put these in our storage. Say, have you met the photographer? She stopped by my pontoon a little while back. She's loaded up with fancy, fancy camera equipment to take pictures of all the wildlife. She sighs wistfully. 
I wish I had my own camera. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to document everything you do? You never forget anything. Anyway, she said she was setting up on a small island to the south of the Marrows. If you're in the area, maybe you could check on her. Okay, so we gotta go back to that lady. Uh, let's see what she has to say again. Hey again, come by for a chat. Uh, you ever see strange things out at sea? Hmm. Strange things? Plenty, but I try not to dwell on them. You could go crazy, you know? Ha. Huh. But hey, if you're seeing strange things, maybe you're not seeing them the right way. Maybe they're not so strange after all. Or perhaps they are... Or perhaps they are, and they're incredibly dangerous. Better not risk it. Is there anything else you would like to talk about? Are you always out on the water? Yeah, always. I like to keep moving along. I'm merchanting is secondary to the traveling really. I'm more of a merchanting traveler. I get to see a lot of places which is nice. I also get to meet a lot of people which is only sometimes nice. What do you know about Gale Cliffs? Well there's Ingfell just across the bay which is a dreary little willing town. The folks, are, the folks there are always in need of something which keeps me in business. Mm. Residents are always trying to, are always talking about the cliffs. Most seem to seem afraid. Frankly, I'm not sure why they stay. Occasionally, I hear deep rumbling from the, from within the rocks. I don't hang, I don't hang around there for long. Is there anything else? Okay, do you need help with anything? Assistance from an angler? Absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where each fish or each species of fish is located. Okay. I figured out most of them on the or I figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't seen, haven't been able to track down. Reckon you could share your info with me? Sure, I could help with that. Great, the fish I have less to track down are the oarfish, the gulper eel, goliath tigerfish, and colican. I know a little about each species already, so I, maybe I can point you in the right direction. Hmm. Okay, where do you find the oarfish? Given that the oarfish has a long, fragile body, I suspect they'll live reasonable, reasonably deep, but calm water. Maybe the shelter of Gale Cliffs would suit them. All right. What about gulper eels? I know gulper eels live in the live in the deepest depths imaginable. You'll have to get some specialist some specialist gear to catch one of those. Goliath Tigerfish. These guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky swampy waters using the shade of trees as cover. And Colocanths? Actually I have no idea where Colocanths might be, but they'll have a formidable, formidable, primordial feel to them. I do not know. Primordial feel to them, don't you think? Yeah. What about those rare fish you wanted me to find? What do you want to know? Okay. So we just gotta go look for those fish. Hmm. It might be used to dry docks at the at other ports, but we can make some upgrades at, to your boat here at this floating dock. Check it out. Oh, we can just go on the run too. Awesome. And then the shipyard. Most of your gear, most of this gear is super heavy, so I don't offload it at every platoon. Pontoon. 
What are about coming board and see the equipment I got for sale. Oh, look at that. I'll buy... Ooh. I'll buy the research part. That research part, and then this will be for our hole. Okay. We got bigger lights, too. Can we just... Oops. Oh, we can install it. Okay. Will you take this? Okay. And then we don't have enough for that. If we sold... Which one's better? 14, 15, 14... Seven. So if we take this out, we install it here, and we take this off, and just sell that and then put this one on. Okay, now we can get. Mangrove and coastal. I don't need that. It's already dark out. I'm go to the dock. Okay, now we just need two pieces of lumber. That's good. We can get a new hole. Let's rest. Get to that little town. Holy crap, we're so fast. What's this? A bottle. Let's get a little bit of fishing done. This is a new fish. Black sea bass. What this little town has. We got storage. We can put these back real quick. Oh, we're supposed to sell that one. Okay, so we have nothing to do. Oh. Ingfell Resident. Huh. What is it? Where can I sell my fish here? We catch our fish by ourselves. So we don't have much need for buying any. But there's a merchant that travels around. She's usually anchored across the bay. She buys and sells almost anything. She does repairs too. Okay, so that was the lady that we just met. Do you know any odd characters around mm. these parts? Have you heard the tale of the Margren? He was an old whaler from these parts. As the whales got more and more scarce, the crew spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. Margren, it seems wasn't cut out for this he formed an unnatural attachment to be or to a scroll he found at one of these ships or one of these trips he says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish people started calling him Margin the fishman 
One day the town awoke to find the boat find all the boats, nets, and lines had been slashed in the night. And old Morgan was nowhere to be found. Nor has he been seen since. What about the cliffs? Many years ago the cliffs used to be a haven for smugglers and pirates. Legend tells of two pirate lords who get who used Gilgum cliffs as their hideout. Supposedly, they got into dis some disagreement and a huge battle was fought around the south side of the cliffs. There certainly are a large number of wrecks in that area. Go dredging in there. Both sides were completely destroyed. Their treasure hordes left abandoned and unclaimed to this day. I dare say it'd be worth a lot if anyone knew where to find them. You need help with anything. I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner, but I've been having some issues. Around here, we considered age conjure eels to be a particular delicacy. You may say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Ugh. Normally, we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dogs keep digging them up and eating them. I can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Can you bring me an aged conjure eel? Mm, yeah. Thank you. You'll be decently compensated. Anything else? Or can hmm. I catch one of them? Ah, yes. They can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you may have to venture into the passageways of the cliffs to find them. Oh, and did I mention they only come out at night? Yes, I believe they hide during the day. Good luck. Uh, I don't think so. Let's talk to the retired hmm. whaler. What is it? Are there any shipwrecks around here? Hmm. The real wreck around here is the settlement at Gale Cliffs. My brother ditched us and moved on over to those cliffs years ago. I suspect he's regretting his decision now. The devil. Okay, anything strange? Some time ago, after the last well was brought in, there was a sudden exodus of Gale, Gale Cliffs. From Gale Cliffs. Dozens of ships sailed past, packed up and hurrying away north as fast as they could. They were waving and shouting something at us from their boats, but we couldn't make it out. Never did see or hear of them since. Can you tell me about Ingfell? Ingfell used to be a whaling town. Emphasis on used to be. We would go out, bring the carcass, bring in a carcass, and then the rest of the town would get to work. But the whales got scarce some 20 years ago. And now look at us, barely scraping by for a new candle. No. So we go into the cliffs. Oops. Let's see what we got in here. What kind of fish? Oh, that's a different. Oh, that's a tiny fish. Very easy to catch. Catch a few of these. There's a lot of them here. Oh, depleted. Um, it's over here. These look like the same. 
some dredging material. Oh, we don't have a lot of room. Actually, if we take these, since they're only one wide, we can move those and then back up. Dredge for one more piece of metal. Okay. There's still more metal to be dredged there. I need to go out at night. An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Ah, ah greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it that you need? Uh, what's happening to these cliffs? They're becoming consumed from the core by that hateful serpent. Have you seen it? Uh, no, not yet. Nobody would believe me. Not until it started devouring our foundations, opening up chas chasms beneath our homes. It was nightmarish. Waking in the night to the sound of a creature slithering somewhere underneath. It seems to have turned its attentions elsewhere, but not before it took everything from me. What else do you want to know? Uh, do you know of any shipwrecks? Someone that used to live here kept their ship moored at the base of the cliff until it was struck by something or some falling rocks and sunk to the bottom. They were devastated at the lost. We all were. It was a beautiful boat decorated with all manner of memorabilia from their travels. At low tide, I can still see what's left of the masthead poking through the waves. Tell me more about the creatures that live in the cliffs. It's been burrowing tunnel tunnels through the base of the cliffs. You can see the gigantic holes it leaves just below the surface. As it forces its way out, it often causes rocks fall rock falls. So if you plan on going in there, keep an ear out. Should it catch sight of you? Well, you should be able to outrun it. It's quite slow, provided you can navigate the passageways. This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? Aye. I've been stubbornly holding... One second, sorry. Oh, I had a sneeze. I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told. I've been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Now I'm alone and cut off by land and sea. I left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move to Ingfell. It's not that simple. My brother would never. You see, I used to leave, live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad and we fought a lot, mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We were in the middle of prime foolishness in our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Give it back to him. Again, it's not as simple as that. After the collapse of that creature, it dredged debris from the house down into the wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know. But if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world to me. Alright, I'll look for it. Thank you, but please be careful. All right. I want to get to that boat. Oops. Um, undock. Wait, was there a 
Can I get to the storage? Yes, I can. That's installed, installed, installed. Okay. So we need a dredge. Damn it, I keep doing that. We need a dredge for some materials, which there's some around us. Let's go through here, and we've got to watch out for a serpent. Start dredging through this. Oh, that was the last one of those. There we go. Seven fifty nine. We need to go back to this lady. These eels? No. I think the eels are Shipyard. I've got a surprise for you. A gift for my most loyal customer. Here, I want you to have this. Art of the Silver Tongue. Add it to the cabin. She takes a book, hands it to you. Looking through, you see page. You see page corners turned in and handwritten notes in the margins. Okay. Okay. So. Ooh, more? Can I buy this? Oh, we're out of money. Okay, hold on. Fish market. When trolling, pay attention to how deep the water is. Not every type of fish likes deep water. Check your encyclopedia if you're not too sure. Five, that's it. Can I research? Yes. Okay. We got that one. We're pretty fast already. We can do a better net. Look at that. Volcanic and coastal. Mangrove and shallows? I thought we were rich and we have no money left. So what do we need? Relics, catch rare fish, family crest, and a rotting eel. New book. Map. So there's two wrecks. Messages. I don't know. I don't want to read all those. Okay. Now we can go to the shipyard. Installing a trolling net is great. is a great way to earn some passive income while exploring the islands. Wonder if that's what we got to do to. Coastal, coastal. Lasts for two days. 
She only has one research part now. Five bucks for that? Those aren't worth anything. Okay. I thought we could upgrade our boat here. Oh yeah, the dock. Okay, storage. This one. This one. Oh, and it's 500. Okay. Wait. No, I guess we gotta rest the rest of the way. Alright, back to... Tons of fishing, I guess. Holy crap, that's huge. Can't do too many of those. Oh. Okay, hold on. Research part. What is this? A pile of loose debris. Clearing this would take some strong explosives. Ah, damn, noises in this. Okay. Can't get anything else, really. Let's back up. sell the fish to this lady. Actually, we could go to the storage and just get like another passive income. If we go to storage take all of these. We can also put this on. I don't know if we need to. Install equipment into every slot on your ship. Achievement get. 